On Monday, October 17th of 2022, Ezra Miller pleaded not guilty to a felony count of burglary into an occupied dwelling and a minor charge of petite larceny after they were caught on video recording stealing bottles of liquor from a neighbor's home. Now, this is just one incident in a whole legacy of arrests and reports of rather uh, interesting behavior by the actor all across the US from Hawaii to Vermont. Miller, who is now 30, appeared virtually with their attorney, Lisa B. Shellcrot, for the arraignment in Bennington Superior Court. As well as pleading not guilty, they also agreed to conditions that they will not have any contact with the homeowner or go to the residence. The homeowner, Isaac Winokur, said he has been friends with Miller for about 18 years and bought the home a year and a half ago in the same town where Miller had also purchased the home. According to court documents of the May 1st incident, Miller told law enforcement at the time that they were friends with the homeowner and had entered the residence unannounced to borrow cooking ingredients. But despite being friends, Miller was still charged after police consulted surveillance footage and interviewed witnesses. On May 2nd, law enforcement found Winokur's living room in a not so clean state with disregarded cigarettes and lighters and his pantry in tatters with his stuff on the floor. Their attorney made a statement in which she said, quote, Ezra Miller this morning pled not guilty to one count of burglary and one count of petite larceny in Vermont Superior Court and accepted the court imposed conditions of not contacting or entering the home of the inhabitants. Ezra would like to acknowledge the love and support they have received from their family and friends who continue to be a vital presence in their ongoing mental health. The actor is still set to star in Warner Brothers' The Flash movie reprising their role from Justice League and Warner Bros. Discovery has not deviated from its plan to release The Flash in June 2023, even in light of all the not so great press surrounding the actor. Ezra Miller has also said that they are seeking treatment for their mental health issues. A week after they were charged for the burglary, they said in a statement, quote, I now understand that I am suffering complex mental health issues and have begun ongoing treatment. I want to apologize to everyone that I have alarmed and upset with my past behavior. I am committed to doing the necessary work to get back to a healthy, safe, and productive stage in my life. But that's the information. Now it's your turn to let us know your thoughts down in the comments. I'm Adam Andrews, this is Inform Overload, ta-ta and farewell.